The Mani Silk Simple Pack configuration is used in straight canals. The Standard Pack configuration is used in canals with mild curvature, and the Complex Pack configuration is used in canals with moderate to severe curvature and calcification. Any endodontic motor can be used to power Mani Silk. 500 RPM is recommended with a torque setting of 300 gram centimeters. Using Mani Silk clinically, the clinician first creates straight line access. The cervical dentinal triangle is removed with the Mani Silk orifice opener using a brushing motion up and away from the furcation. Next, the clinician should negotiate the canal and establish both patency and determine the true working length. Mani D-Finders are stiff hand files that are excellent for this purpose. Alternatively, Mani K-Files and Mani Seco K-Files, which are safe-ended, are well suited for this purpose. Once the clinician reaches the apex, it is recommended that the true working length be confirmed with an apex locator and or a radiograph. To make way for the remaining Mani Silk instruments, a glide path is prepared. Regardless of whether the clinician is using D-Finders, K-Files, or Seco K-Files, when the canal is enlarged to approximately a size 20 hand file, the canal is ready for Mani Silk. Mani Silk files are used from the left side of the pack to the right. Using a continuous, gentle, and controlled three-second insertion, the middle file in the given pack configuration is used first, followed by the file on the right-hand side of the pack. Using the standard pack as an example, this means that after the orifice is shaped and the glide path made, the .0620 instrument is inserted first, followed by the .0625. After inserting each Mani Silk file, the canal should be irrigated and a hand file inserted to assure that the canal is open and negotiable. The .0620 and .0625 are alternatively inserted until the apex is reached. Insertion is gentle, passive, and takes approximately 3 seconds per insertion. Once shaping is completed, the canal may be obturated in any clinically appropriate manner.